Good morning. My name is Ferdinand Kahadas from Amritsu. I'm from the engineering and technology team here in EMEA. And here and today, we would like to present you a novel and new way of measuring any kind of antenna in the E-band range. Why is this so important today? On the background of 5G, uh, it is very important to have the capability to measure antennas. And to measure antenna, you have to have first a VNA. And this Shockline Anritsu E-band VNA is a very novel piece of technology. We are using for any kind of frequency conversion the so-called non-linear transmission line principle. And that is the reason why these modules are so tiny and so small. And with two of these modules and two of the antennas, we are able to measure antenna pattern. What is missing is you have to have a rotating table. And on this rotating table is the antenna under test. And what we would like to do next is this antenna is start rotating and this antenna is sending a signal and then we can see the antenna radiation pattern. So first of all, the antenna is moving into a start position and then the antenna is moving back in equidistant azimuth points until the antenna has arrived on the other end. And this is here just a proof of concept. Usually an antenna is radiating in the azimuth as well as in the elevation. And then finally, you are getting this nice looking three-dimensional antenna radiation pattern. And this is the result what engineers are looking for in order to characterize antennas for 5G applications or antennas that are not any more separate. This means antennas that are based on the chip level. And for this kind of applications, you must have the ability to maneuver the VNA modules in a very easy way. So let me summarize. We have here a technology that is unique, starting at 52 gigahertz, going up to 92 gigahertz in a technology that is called nonlinear transmission line. And it is also possible to extend the short cables up to 10 meter cables here. And by doing this, it is possible to dislocate the antenna modules for more or less any kind of antenna measurements. Thank you very much for attention. That was a very brief introduction into the Anritsu way of measuring E-band antennas in today's world.